G'day guys and welcome back to Aussie Gamer. Look, I've got all the GDC news and specifically Phil Spencer is currently at GDC talking about the Xbox One and Windows 10. Now in some huge news out of GDC, Phil Spencer has just confirmed that the Xbox One will be getting a 20% GPU boost thanks to DirectX 12. Now I've also heard that the Xbox One will be getting a 50% CPU boost, also thanks to DirectX 12. So all of that indicates to me that the Xbox One is going to get a significant performance increase over the next few weeks, months and possibly even years. Now one of the things that Phil also went on to talk about was the fact that they're really building this Microsoft ecosystem uh, and I think it all starts with Windows 10 where developers have the opportunity to develop a game not just for the Xbox now but for the whole Windows 10 platform which as you guys know will be available for phones, tablets, uh, computers and of course the Xbox One as well. So a whole ecosystem that really leverages not just the power of Windows or Windows 10 but certainly DirectX 12 as well. Now one of the things that Microsoft showed today at GDC that really emphasizes this is the fact that more and more games look like they're going cross-platform and cross-play. Now as you can see here on screen, Phil Spencer and a couple of other guys from the Microsoft team also demonstrated IDAR being played on Windows 10 and Xbox One. So I think the motto kind of came up that uh, basically you can pick something up on one device and finish it on another, which again sounds pretty damn cool. Now Unreal Tournament was uh, announced to be available for PC free right now, which is pretty damn cool. I, I think uh, a lot of us have some really fond memories of Unreal Tournament and if you haven't checked it out, uh, I think it's pretty damn awesome, so go and give it a crack. Now one of the more interesting things that uh, Microsoft have in their portfolio is HoloLens. And one of the things that Phil emphasized today was the fact that Xbox will bring games to HoloLens, which to me is pretty damn exciting. So in terms of some of the games that were announced, we've got a little bit of a list for you. We've got a game called Sorty, uh, another one called This War of Mine, Wasteland 2, Cuphead, and, uh, and Shovel Knight. Now Battletoads are coming to Shovel Knight, so uh, that's pretty cool. I know that there's been a little bit of speculation, a little bit of hype about that game, so again, that's pretty damn cool. Now there was also another game which looks very exciting called Gigantic, which is some sort of a shooter MOBA RPG mashup. So again, that looks pretty exciting and uh, I can't wait to check that one out. So in other news from Phil's presentation, he did also announce that a wireless adapter for the Xbox One controller uh, and that being able to work on Windows 10 will be coming out later this year so uh, again looking to expand the horizons of what the Xbox One and all of its devices can actually do across multiple platforms so that's pretty damn exciting. So there you go guys that's basically the Microsoft uh, Xbox Phil Spencer introductory uh, presentation and one of the really cool things about it is the fact that the Xbox one will be getting a 20% GPU boost now looking at the buzz on Twitter there does seem to be a, a number of camps so those who are disappointed by that announcement thinking 20% is perhaps not enough and those who are thinking yeah great 20% is pretty damn exciting now I for one sit in the pretty damn excited camp and the reason for that is how often do you purchase a device only to have that device a year later become 20% more powerful. And for me, any improvements in performance, whether it be from Microsoft's Xbox or Sony's PlayStation 4, to me is absolutely phenomenal and pretty damn exciting. So there you go, guys. If you've liked today's video, please remember to hit that like button for me. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And as always, guys, get involved in the conversation via the comments section down below. All right, guys, I will see you all in the next video.